Hey, what's up YouTube? My name's Aiden, and I was a professional Apex player for Oxygen Esports, participating in both LGS Pro League splits 1 and 2, and I primarily play controller, and recently I've been spending a lot of time firing range to help improve my aim, so I decided to record myself doing my entire warm-up, and I ended up breaking it down into five different drills that you guys could try to hopefully help improve your overall aim on controller. So without further ado, let's get into the drills. Alright, so up first we have is shooting random targets. You can do this with a car or a flatline, but preferably a car to make it harder because of its strafe speed. It's gonna feel weird shooting targets in no particular order at first, but if you want, you can try some of the combinations that I'm doing in the video to start out with. I really like this drill as it practices shooting vertically, diagonally, horizontally, and it gets you more comfortable with the thumbstick overall. One thing that I did forget to mention is that all these drills will be done with a gold magazine and a 1 or 2 HCOG sight, so keep that in mind. Next up, we have SMG tracking. In this drill, the goal is to aim only for headshots and strafe side to side to make it harder to track the dummies. Try not to strafe forwards and backwards at all, as this will only make it easier. You can move around the entire firing range for this drill, and I encourage it, as you could try shooting the dummies at short, medium, and long range. Don't be afraid to mix it up with some hip fire sprays and some sliding as well. Now, we're gonna get started with some assault rifle recoil control. In my opinion, the only recoils worth practicing are the flatline and R301, and maybe a couple SMGs, but for this drill, we're gonna be focusing on the flatline and 301. To complete this drill, we first need to shoot a wall to analyze the recoil of the weapon we're using, then we attempt to control it by shooting the target shown here. This is very difficult, so don't feel bad if you're missing practically every shot. I was the same way. For the fourth drill, we have some more recoil control, particularly for the R301 and Flatline. It has pretty much the same steps as the third drill, but now we're gonna get a little closer to the target, and our goal is to get as many headshots as possible. So you wanna be aiming for the center of the moving target. I recommend doing this with a 1H cog a little closer up, and a 2X sight a little farther away, so you can get practice with both optics. The second part of this drill is doing the same thing but on the actual dummies. Same thing as before, you could try this at a bit longer range with a 2x or 1x, and the aim is to strafe side to side and only go for headshots. Last but not least, we have wingman headshots. Exactly as the name says, you're only aiming for headshots while strafing side to side, and the goal is to get to the point where you can kill all three dummies with one magazine. There's also another variation for this drill, where you shoot two bullets on each of the targets in no particular order. You can give both a try and decide which you like best. Alright, but that is going to bring us to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe, and if any of you have any ideas for other firing range drills that I might have missed or forgotten about, feel free to let me know in the comments. Hopefully this video helped you out, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.